I try to clean up for the party as best as I could, but I'm sure there are all kinds of things lying around everywhere that I didn't get a chance to put away. I swear though, things have been going missing. I better not find out anybody's been stealing shit. It's not my fault that kid got arrested. I only supply. You don't arrest the jockey when the horse dies from an overdose of a combination of cocaine and alcohol. I think you're imagining things, Ash. You're too biased. I know she's finding a way to interrupt my phone calls. And when I find out how... Well, did you find Madison's thick boy? Derek? Is he the thick boy with the thighs that can probably crush my face? Amazing! I can't wait to have a man meet. Let me just... Collect myself, and off we go! <gasps> but some of their initiation tasks seem kind of weird and borderline unachievable. Hello again. Okay, so next up I need... Oh gosh, I need to get a condom from a stranger. If this is too embarrassing for you, you can let me know and I'll understand. I think I'd die if I had to do this myself. Derek, I'm Letty, and oh man, have I wanted to me. Eh. Whoa. Look at you. I think I had man meat all wrong. You really are meaty. You're like a big piece of handsome steak. It makes total sense you're called man meat. Let me touch your meaty man boobies. What the hell? These aren't man boobs. These are pecs, damn it. My upper chest is goddamn spectacular. Yo, come on now. I. This shit is. Uh, really bringing up some bad memories from high school. Ah, get the pasa, pendejo. I said take a feel on Derek, not me. I have lady meat, not man meat. Thanks, dude. That's what I'm talking about. Didn't feel too good, did it, Letty? But when I heard someone say man meat, I just thought it was like a badge of honor. Like, you're super jacked, bro. That's all I was trying to say. Ah, it's cool, man. I mean, I'm ripped as shit. Just ask next time before you cop a feel of my lovelies. If you've got some time, maybe I could tell you a bit about my workout routine. Male Kegels do wonders. That was a close call. I have to stop taking things so literally. Madison may actually be a mean girl like in the movies after all. Good for you, buckaroo! Anyways, I'm gonna chat with Derek for a bit. And earlier, I think I recognized this girl I used to know from working the booth babe scene. Hey, give me back that mezcal. It'll be a good icebreaker in case I'm totally wrong. Hey, who's that girl you were talking to? And uh, when will I get to make my introduction? She's gotta meet me, right? I'm dope. I'll show you, bra. I'm fucking dope as hell. Any questions, really, that are small talk or rhetorical, or that you... What's going on? Good to see you again. Hey now, take it easy, all right? We don't drink at this party, or at least that's what Sensei Frank told me to say. Bear. Confidence, Brittany. Just I know this was dumb to do, 
but I stuck my hand in the bug zapper and it went completely limp. Flop, flop, flop. How's it going, dude? Staying away from the alcohol? What is this? Some lame attempt at a Jedi mind trick? You haven't done shit to prove anything to me. Come back when you have some real evidence. Hello again. How's it going, dude? Staying away from the alcohol? Hey again, how's it going? Dance classes in my free time. Most contemporary dance shares the same rules as Brazilian capoeira or Japanese Aikido. Dude, I'm pretty much learning another method of fighting if you think about it. Come on, look at these big lips and these long whiskers. I was born to go down on your girl. They'll give you anything if your roommate died. Is it true that Hey again, are you lost? I need her to autograph some stuff for me, but I gotta wipe it all down first. It's probably pretty sticky. I'm pretty sure Rachel went to school with her. She rolls in her circle. This group welcomed me with open arms. Well, actually, now that I think about it, I don't think they ever officially welcomed me. They just kind of silently and... It's you! Come here! I've got a secret. The mezcal you gave back to me, I found a way to make the bottle get lighter and lighter and lighter. I can't tell you how the trick is done, but I'll give you a hint. My breath smells like scorpions. And so we met the host. We met her man meat. Oh God, what other movie stereotypes could we find at this party? Oh, oh, okay. You know those girl characters who are like, how do you say, experimental? Like they have a drunken sleepover with a best friend which turns into the whole who kisses better game, and then that turns into the whole who sits on faces better game. I may have had one too many sips of the, uh, Arachnikila? <laughs> Mescal is my best pal, huh? <laughs> anyway, yeah man, like, every young lady needs to have her first time with another lady and i'm not saying i'm gonna use this awesome level of drunk to try it but i'm also like not not saying that either go see if you can't find somebody willing to test the waters of girl on girl love L like just for this movie video game thingy we're playing <laughs> Of course. Brittany! I like that name. Brittany. Let's go meet her! Oh, uh, just because of how the whole Derek thing went, I'm thinking I should just stick to giving away the rest of my teaching materials. I mean gifts! Alrighty. Madison nailed that fish, so we should... Wait, back it up. She mounted that fish. She took the fish from us! I know you kept a close watch over my other gifts, so which do you think Brittany would totes love? Hopefully this gift is exactly what Brittany needs to open her mind to opening other things. <laughs> yeah, I'll mosey my way over to her when I see a chance. Keep an eye out for... No, I won't remember the signal. Just pay attention! 
this combat in any other way is simply not giving you all the All right, you counted down. That means you actually have to meet somebody now. I wish more people were dancing. I love dancing so much. I've gotten at least three concussions from trying to dance all night and spontaneously passing out. What? Don't look at me all judgy like that. I wish my wrestling. Yeah, baby. I was just saying how like we need more bodies on the dance the floor. On my face. Woo, let's light it up. We looked better in Alpha. Ugh. What fucking spell barrier do you guys use? How am I supposed to make the like miserable if I can't even record these recordings that I can't give a fuck about all be covered in sexy, horny fuck bits 24-7 and chicken wings? How long do these kind of parties last? Could I go ahead and slip out? I think everybody's seen me. So, is Madison really an artist? Or is it one of those things, like when a washed up child actor starts a rock band? I don't really get that metaphor. Hola, Brittany. How you doing? I'm Letty, budding party enthusiast. And I just wanted to come say hello and let you know that I think you're the prettiest chica at this party, no matter what the mean girls in the cafeteria say. Well, I must admit, even from afar, I couldn't help but notice all you've been up to. And now, well, golly, I'm sure glad I came back up here to accidentally stumble into you. Oh, and look, I've even brought you something. Mama Chupacabra's chili peppers. It's only right that the hottest thing on the planet goes with the hottest girl at the party, right? Oh my, I love spicy stuff. Reminds me a lot of home. Letty, you've really got me feeling... Well, these peppers aren't the only thing that's hot right now. Oh my god, you are so fucking cute. I just wanna just... Ugh, come here, you. My turn to be a stupid party stereotype. I miss Pergalicious so much, man. Dude, watching over this party is so fucking tiring. Looking to get in on this action? I had other plans for you down the line. But if you want to skip ahead, I think Brittany and I could make that work. Anybody want to help me pull a crazy prank on my sister? What's one more flavor added to the pot? As long as they bring the spice, come on over here. Well, since you've blown me and Brittany away tonight, I think it's only fair we offer to return the favor. Do you need me for any of this? Oh god, your boner is no, 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 breaking no. through the They're zipper. Not as big as you think. That's metal, dude. How are you doing that? Yeah. I've been having to do admin no, tutoring to get through my Spanish <laughs> Oh, wow! Woo! <laughs> well, that was muy caliente. Oh, shit! People can see us! Cover up, dude! <laughs> yeah, that may have been the perfect third act of my first party. Or at least it's getting there. You know those cheesy plot lines where the girl realizes it's her best friend she should have been with the entire time? I'm starting to sense that's what's happening here. I'm simply saying that you and I should go somewhere private. Somewhere with a bed and a door that... Finish that sentence, damn it! Whoa, bro! I can see your thing! It, it's bigger than my thing. Why, hello there, lady. I've seen you around tonight, shaking hands, making friends, kissing girls. 
but I can't help but brodis that you've yet to make doth mine bra acquaintance. Oh, hey there. Uh, didn't mean to leave you hanging, just making friends based off a very rigid list of movie stereotypes. You know, just going off the crazed look in your eye and the faint smell of urine emanating from your pants, I'd say you'd fit the typecast of the total wild card. Yes, I'd say that's exactly what I am. My name is Patrick Donghauser. Moneymakers Monthly called me a disruptor in the boardroom and a sexual harassment lawsuit waiting to happen. You see, I make a lot of money, and I've made several women feel uncomfortable. Hmm. Tell me more, stud muffin. Oh! Well, well, what's this I feel near my back, Brocket? Ah, it's very red and wet. I'm, uh, known to keep many old food items in my persons for later consumption on the go. Just one of my many life hacks. Don't mind me, I'm just gonna fuel up real quick on this wet candy. Oh, yeah, <clears throat> right, this is my spicy candy. <laughs> yeah, this candy is lava-flavored. Patrick, is that Zvian? Sorry, I don't speak Brahili. <laughs> oh, oh, I'm even starting to feel this in my nether regions. <clears throat> Didn't you know you were eating Mama Chupacabra's chili peppers? Ah, that was a chili pepper? I feel like my butthole is the sun, Letty Bra. I need help! Damn you, Mama Chupacabra! Well, Patrick may have been a little too close to his movie stereotype, but I guess every party needs its stupid dumbass. So, how about you find us a comfy spot? Have you found us a secluded spot? Really, all we need is a door. And I guess the walls around the door. And a bed! Hurry up, I can smell Patrick's cologne in the air. I can only assume he's musking up for round two. Uh, yes! To Madison's room! Um, so... That was fucking awesome. I hope Madison doesn't mind that we did that in her bed though hey <laughs> yep hey if you ever want to do that in her bed again just come find me but man what a dope first house party adios for now Hey, how's it going, buddy? I, I figured you'd hear it through the grapevine eventually. I should have told you myself. I appreciate your concern, though. If I find that guy that sold him that meth, I'm gonna lose my shit. Hey, how's it going, buddy? Ha! Well, I should hope so. I did nothing but make you look bad every time we went out to the club together. Hope you got some professional help, because I would have considered you a lost cause. They're simply too fucking big. Shares the same moves as Brazilian capoeira or Japanese Aikido. How's it going, dude? Staying away from the alcohol?
Due to my supernatural sized balls, I can survive for over a week without food or water. Depending on Hey, how's it going? Obviously. I think there's a water suppository in there somewhere. Um, sure. I guess that's okay. You kind of did me a solid earlier. It's 555-4242. Five, 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 four, two, four, two. Did you need something? Yeah, I noticed he's being his typical douchebag self tonight. If you can come up with a way around him, let me know and I'll help out if I can. Ugh, as if. I don't drink any of that beer and wine shit. Give me a good old shot of rum any day over that other crap. I was valedictorian of my class and I have a master's in engineering. Do I know how to hack a phone? Seriously? I could do it in my sleep. By hypothetically, you mean you want me to do it for you, right? Just get me a laptop with internet and a mobile phone I can use and I'll send your message for you. I'm not going to do it with my own shit. There are ways of tracing these things back if somebody really wanted to. I think I have an idea of whose phone you could use. Patrick. Staring at it in the tree. If it ain't my best bra from another brother, that one doesn't work so well. Anyways, how good's our plan? Frank Schmack. <laughs> he doesn't scare me. Twas easy, bra. Every time I saw Frank, I hid it down the front of my pants. I was here before Frank got here, and when he showed up and started scooping up all of the booze, I just threw that baby down my pants. 